When it comes to energy policy, Minnesota is moving in the right direction. The Conservation Improvement Statute and Next Generation Energy Act encourage utilities to invest in conservation and energy efficiency efforts. But what happens when those investing in energy efficiency don't see the energy savings? Rental units like this building here make up 26% of all housing units in Minnesota, and that number is even higher in urban areas. I pick the appliances, I have them installed. It, you know, it's not me that's paying the utility bill every month. And, and oftentimes when people are renting the apartment, it's not something that they are thinking about at that time because you know, they're thinking about so many other things. The energy efficiency is something that, that landlords would think about when the vacancy rates are low because then they might have a little bit more money um, to spend on these kind of things. The split incentives barrier occurs in rental housing when property owners purchase or pay the upfront cost for an appliance, but the tenant pays for the use of that appliance. So property owners have no economic incentive to purchase an energy efficient appliance. For this report, we focused on refrigerators in rental housing units because they illustrate how public policy can best overcome the split incentives barrier. Take this refrigerator for example. This one is almost 20 years old and uses a lot more electricity than a new energy efficient refrigerator. In our study, we found that replacing all the refrigerators that are 10 years old or more in the Twin Cities Metro could save almost 36 gigawatt hours every year, or enough energy to power 3,100 average American households, and save consumers almost $3.7 million every year. So there's a lot of potential here for energy efficiency efforts in rental housing in Minnesota. But current policy does not provide the incentives needed for property owners to purchase energy efficient appliances. We examined four policy options that align the financial incentives of property owners, tenants, and utilities to enable energy efficient upgrades where everybody wins. This is where we see public policy providing sensible incentives to enable energy efficient choices in rental housing in Minnesota.